Hi guys, Matt from 123MyOT here. In this video, I will show you how to create a Windows 11 bootable USB. Creating a bootable Windows 11 USB will allow you to install Windows 11 on multiple computers. You will need a USB flash drive that is at least 8GB in size, and you will need a copy of Windows 11. To download a copy of Windows 11, you can check out the how to download Windows 11 video I did earlier and I will put a link in the top of the video now. Once you have followed my other video and downloaded the Windows 11 ISO file, plug in your USB drive to your computer. We will be formatting the USB so make sure you do a backup of any files on the USB as this process will wipe any files on the USB. Open up Disk Management by right clicking the Start button or in the search field you can type Partitions and then click the top result. The Disk Management screen should pop up. Find your USB drive. In this case, I know my USB drive was around about 60 gigabytes in size. Just make sure you have the correct drive because this next step will delete the data on the USB. Delete all the partitions on your removable USB drive by right clicking on each and selecting the Delete Volume. Cool, once you've done that, just right click again and create new simple volume. Click next and then type 1000 in the simple volume field. Click next and next again. And then set your file system to FAT32 and rename your volume label as boot part. Then click Next and Finish. If you've done that right, the drive will pop up in Windows. Do the same steps again, but in the volume label type Data Part. Click Next and then Finish. The data part window will also pop up. Just go ahead and close it. Double click on the Windows 11 ISO file and copy all the files and folders except the sources folder from the Windows 11 ISO to the FAT32 boot part partition on the USB drive. To do this, select all your files and then hold down Control and click on the Sources folder. This will exclude the folder from the copy. Once you've done that, just drag the files across to the boot part partition on the USB. Once they're all copied, go ahead and create a new empty Sources folder. Make sure it's the same name as the Sources folder you didn't copy across. Next, go into the Sources folder and find a file called boot.wim and copy it to the New Sources folder on the USB drive. Cool, now go to the disk part partition on the USB and copy all the files from the Windows 11 ISO folder to the disk part partition. Awesome, 
Once the files have copied across, you have finished creating a Windows 11 bootable USB. You can now use this USB to install Windows 11 on any computer. In my next video, I will show you how to use this USB to do a clean install of Windows 11. Guys, don't forget to check out my other videos such as how to fix the PC must support TMP 2.0 error on HP. And do me a favor, if you know anyone who might like this video, please share it with them, hit the subscribe button and smash the bell icon.